And I'm Sorik. And we're on the Leviathan server in the Goblet. Yeah, and boy, have we got a treat for you. Uh, one of the most active FCs in the world today, the Juno FC has invited us to come and take a look at their uh, comings and goings here. Yeah, I'm excited. I am too. They've got a large here in the Goblet, and they've got all kinds of stuff going on. What do you think of the new, uh, first of all, all the people everywhere? Yeah. They've got guys up on the roof. How did they do that? <laughs> Let's check out their uh, house here. G-Spot. Plot 30, first word of the goblet. Welcome to the G-Spot. Congratulations for locating what many before you could not find. Everyone is welcome to our <laughs> FC. We have many raid groups, casual players, and more. We have a TeamSpeak server. Read about us at www.juno.net and they do everything. Nice. 119 members currently online. I've never seen that before. Yeah, it's a it's a it's what we call a hyperactive uh, guild or free company. Got just people everywhere yeah. hanging out. <laughs> I really like those new trees. They look like pink cotton balls. <laughs> yeah, that's the the trees from the Sea of Clouds. They, they look like mog palms to me. Yeah. They're very cool. Now, I would love to know how they made the chokeable staple. Oh, that was just a visual glitch because there are so many people here. Didn't that look cool? That did look cool. For a second, I was wondering, why is the chokeable staples gone? <laughs> they got Carbuncle taking a bath. Oh. <laughs> Where's the person? Oh, right there. <laughs> well done. That was actually a pretty cool effect. The yard is awesome, especially because the trees set it off. Um, I love how wide open it is. An FC like this should always have wide open spaces for a lot of traffic. Agreed. So we've got everybody hanging out here for us. Hi like, guys. Hey guys. They got everybody together. Let's check out the inside of this house. Can't so, wait what we find. Yeah, last week they were ranked uh, number two in the world in activity. That's amazing. Yeah. Oh, they're definitely celebrating here. <laughs> they're going to be on Cribs, Sadaharu, Marin, Sweet Sahoma. All these guys. Look at the. There's Batman and Batgirl Gotham up here and Gilroy. How very, very cool. That's so cute. <laughs> Let's check out this side here. We've got, uh, oh, a conference room. Nice. That's very cool. we got people in the conference room hanging out. I like the way that this is set up. It's really homey feel. I like the this carpet for the second floor. They've got all the portraits up on the walls. Yeah, I like how they put the portraits up in this room. Some really good ideas in here. And then we've got... Oh, it's a study. It's kind of a little private office or a study, yeah. I like it. We've got the... A lot, of, a lot of stuff going on. The Gordian Savage counter. If no one's ever seen the arcing electricity on the Savage uh, armor before. Very cool stuff up here. I like the way this office feels. It's it's a very small space, but they've done really well with it. Yeah. It's very nice. We'll go across the dead zone here. they got the Bahamut statue, and then they've got all the crafting stations up here with the material supplier. Nice. So, it looks like almost all the crafting stations. There are The, the typical ones are missing. Most notably Culinarian. They usually... Oh, there it is. Yeah, I think all of them are here, right? Yeah, it looks like they are all here. You never very, see very that. Cool. No, you never do see that. So let's check out the ground floor. We went upstairs first. We've got the, the Junk Monger and the Mender. Really close, easy to find with the Retainer Bell. Convenient For, is key. Convenient is key. we got the Armor back here as well. Look what they've done with this space. They've divided it in, in four different sections. Using sectionals and large partitions together with pillars to be able to make... Um, make it really go through the space. It's very well divided. A lot of seating areas that are just hidden and secluded so that you feel like you're in a private room with someone but you're yet still in the main part of the house. Yeah. It's really well done. It's a very unique and, feel. Oh. oh. <laughs> Looks like there's a funeral going on. It's a car. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen this thing before and this just popped open. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. What a cool little room. That's great. I like that coffin. Yeah. Let's get one for ourselves. <laughs> Let's check out the other side here. We've got uh, well, a little. All the musical stations are divided here with the uh, with the uh, ADS stuff. Yeah. Cal's hanging out here. Down in the basement. I'm excited to see the basement of this house. <laughs> After everything I've seen so far, we've got the unending journey. The cutscene player. The wheel. Hey, a wheel that actually has stuff on it. <laughs> Your wheels are ready, guys. A kitchen area. Yeah, they got the maid servant here, and I see some carbuncle over there. Oh, yeah. yes. This is really cool what they did. When you come downstairs, you're greeted by this window, uh, and there's food through here. Obviously, the estate maid servant's going to have some stuff to sell as well. Interested to see what's back here. I hear music. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> now this is definitely a strip club. Uh, <laughs> kind of racy, guys. <laughs> well, they they do have their they do have their underclothes on, but this is actually really cool. You got a place to sit around. Um, everybody's kind of dancing, chilling. It's a cute idea. I like it. It's cute. very very happy feel. Another gathering area here. My goodness, Tantalus is tall. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Ren. Hi, Kilia and Tally and Gil again. Let's see what's through here. Uh, yeah. Like a oh hot boy. tub slash shower area. Yeah, <laughs> they got a hot tub party. Go. Uh oh. I have a feeling. Yeah, yeah. it's coming. <laughs> we just got showered. Pop that champagne. <laughs> Bossler, Nix, Minomi, and Aurora hanging out in the bathtub. It's a cool space. It's a really cool idea to to take this and put it to fill a whole corner of the basement. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Maverick and Tolan are pointing at each other. You guys are all wet. <laughs> Look at what they did though with the with the uh, the the altar and then the showers built into the incense things. It's a really unique idea and I. It is. It makes I the like wall. It. it makes the wall glow behind it. You kind of lose a little bit of the smoke coming out of the incense that way. And they've got oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shingen, Batgirl, and Batman are are dancing on the other side. They've got another one built in here. They've got a little room. Ooh, this has got a, what, What's in there? What could this be? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so that's the Juno FC on the Leviathan server. What a fantastic house. What kooky great people these are. Yeah, these guys seem fun. You guys are a lot of fun. Anybody who's on Leviathan, if, I mean, if you don't know who Juno is, I mean, what rock are you hiding under? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Thea. And I'm Sorik. Don't forget to hit the like button to share this video with the world. And don't forget to subscribe to get more Sorik Rise of videos on your feed. Bye. Do you think... Maybe? Possibly? <laughs>